Okay, we're back at it again. Got the same light bulb, same power supply. And get the switch out of here. I think you guys got the idea that these are basically the relay outputs are just contacts of a relay that are acting like a switch. So now I'm connected to output four. And if you look up on my program here, I have four is right here. I have it forced off right now so we don't hear it, but I have it tied to a status bit so it's going to blink. Let me see if I can just light up. It's easier for you guys to see. It's a little closer. So I have it forced off, so it's it's not annoying. But here I'll remove the force. And now you can see the output right there clicking on and off. See the light clicking on and off. And you can hear the click. The click is that contact in there between the v, that last VAC VDC common terminal and output four. It's literally a little block relay in there that is uh, energizing its coil and the armature is opening and closing and that's what the click noise is. You hear the mechanical click of it opening and closing and you can see that it's indicated there. You can see that it's indicated there. That's also why they call these coils. Let me see if I can find my mouse. So right here you probably heard me refer to this OTE as a coil in the past. It's literally the coil inside the relay and the output card of the processor. I mean, this is a, a modular card over here. So when I talk about a coil, I'm really talking about that blue box right there, this individual. So when you're in your software and you energize that up there, you're literally energizing the electromagnet inside a relay of your output card is, is what's happening. And then it's closing the contacts. So whatever you have associated with those contacts is gonna come on. So hopefully that clears some of the confusion up.